Listen. You hear it, right? Sounds like a woman's voice. What do we hit? Hell if I know. I can't see a damn thing. Berto, hold the wheel steady. Greg! Who the hell are you people? Randall! Looks like you caught our thieves. Nice job. You know, every person, they got some dead with them. Who was it for you, Owen? Robo? Your fucking uselessness stops now. Time to earn your keep. Stop! Sam. <laughs> oh, God. You fucking shot him! I didn't mean to! Do you think that matters? Please. Okay, I, I... I screwed up. Randall should be the one laying there. Not your brother. I can't undo what I did, but maybe I can help. I owe you. Both of you. You wanna help? Start by getting us the fuck out of here. Not gonna be easy, but I'll do what I can. Hey, is, is he still breathing? Jonas! I thought you'd have more time. W w what do you mean? Oh, no. Jonas, listen. I, I, I said I'd help them escape. Then we need to disappear, too. Yeah. Okay. Let's find Pete and get the hell off this boat. Thanks, Michonne, for stopping me as much as I wanted to for what he did. I'm glad I didn't kill Zachary. Taking someone's life, that changes you forever. Avoid that burden as long as you can. I, I'll try. Pete's still up there. And he's got company. Okay. We'll distract the guard, then we're out of here. Hey, Joe. Can you give me a hand with something? I couldn't get anything out of him. Zachary was useless. These people just aren't talking. Yeah. Problem is, we still know nothing about him. I'll get him to talk. Don't worry. I have to worry. After last time... With... It won't go down like that. I swear. It can't.
They see me gone. You haven't got a chance of getting out of here. Hey, Randall! You want to tell me how this happened? Zachary! He was guarding the door! Right. Samantha put you up to this? Where is she? Come on. Out with it. I'm only here for Pete. If you find Sam, you can have her. I'm not letting any of you go. Norma, forget about the girl. We can figure this out between us. I would like that, Pete. But your friend here seems to have other ideas. Randall, sound the horn. Sure thing. Drop the machete. I said drop it. aren't you? For now. Come on. Hide! Alarm! We got trouble! Is this an attack? What's happening? Mike, where are the kids? The prisoners escaped in their arms. No! They ran over there. Everyone, listen up! Get down. In here. We're totally screwed. The whole town is looking for us. We'll figure it out. Michonne? I'll see if I can find us a ride out of here. How many are there? Only three. We might have to fight our way out. What? We can't let them escape. We won't. I think we lost them. For now. There's a boat we can use. We'll take them out if we have to. Them or us. No! We are not killing people. I'll give myself up. Pete! It buys you time to escape and no one dies. And I'll find a way back to you. I can reason with these people. That'll never work. Pete, they'll kill you. They won't. You start butchering their people, and our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. I'm doing what's best for my crew. That includes you. When you get your opening, run. We gotta stop him, now! Shoot, no! What are you doing? I could have talked them down. I'm not taking any chances. Get ready. Those people. Let's go, Pete. Holy shit! They're over there! Come on, swim for the boat! <sighs> Hand 
heads off! Get them up! You've already stolen our shit, you're not taking our boat too. You're not gonna shoot me. I bet Norma wants that privilege. Maybe I found you with a bullet in the head. It didn't have to happen this way. You gotta learn to keep your machete on your back, instead of hack your way out. We got out of that mess just fine, didn't we? Wouldn't call that fine. All I'm saying is next time, let me do what I do first. And if that doesn't work, your machete can do the talking. There's no way we can get back to our boat. We can hide out at my house until it's clear. My dad can help you. It's not far. We'll get there before morning. Tired. House sounds pretty good. You could stay there as long as you need. distance between us and Norma. Hope the walkers go for them instead. We can lose them in the woods. How are we gonna do that? Yeah, it's not like we're just gonna walk through those things.
We don't bump into any of them, we'll be fine. Worked. Just be glad it did. gonna have to wait. We'll circle back when things cool off. Better not take long. Don't like the thought of Oak left unsupervised. There's a shortcut to my house, but you're not gonna like it. It's not as bad as it looks. I know the way up. This'll work. You sure this thing's safe? Safer than taking the long way home. If we survive this, I won't complain about going up the rigging anymore. Craig and I climbed it one by one. But I don't think we have time for that. Follow my lead. Some fucking shortcut. Just move. Randall, I found him! This way! Go! Shit!
Michonne. You'll be all right soon. I'm gonna get you home. My house is up ahead. We're not far. I found Norma's place a while back, when it was just a couple of boats anchored to a pier. They, they had some supplies just sitting out, and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. And, and now Greg is dead. Don't beat yourself up, Sam. Why'd she let you go? She took pity on me. I, I told her my family was starving, and... And that was enough. It's like you used up all the pity she's got. This last time, I thought we could just hide this stuff on the ferry. But Greg, he... He didn't think it was safe. I, I should have... Listen... I'm dizzy. Thanks. A clear path. You're not looking so good. I feel even worse. Talking helps. I. I don't want to black out on you. Stay with us, Sam. Your family, what are they like? Dad, Dad was a lawyer. So I never won any arguments with him. Uh, my brothers, James and, uh, and Alex, they look up to Greg so much, they're going to be destroyed. Um, Stick close. It, it's too dangerous out here. Dad was right. He said none of us should leave the house. Walkers are trouble. People are worse. I didn't listen. It wasn't your fault. What happened to Greg? It's oh, not what he's gonna think. We'll help him understand, sir. Sometimes you can't make good out of a bad situation. I, I don't know. How am I supposed to tell my dad about Greg? It's gonna ruin him. Just give him the truth. He deserves to know what really happened. You don't know him like I do. After Mom, he isn't a fan of bad news. Made it. Sam. Sam. Sam, wake up. Can't catch a goddamn break. Come here. My shoulder. We gotta go.
<sighs> Almost there, Sam. Almost home. <sighs> gonna hurt you. We just want to help this girl. Sam, is she dead? Did you kill her? Answer me or I'll shoot. I'm not fucking around. Sam's still alive, but she won't be for long unless you let us in. <coughs> I shan't. Sam? <laughs> Maybe you shot her. Or you? Maybe you'll come in here and kill everyone. I can't take that risk. So just put Sam down and leave. Sam trusted me to get her home. How do you think I found this place? I'm doing this for her, not you. really, really bad. She was shot. <gasps> what? What's your name? I it, it's James. Okay, James. You got a first aid kit? C kind of. Get it. Fast. <sighs> Whatever we're gonna do, we gotta do it fast. What are you doing with that? Sam? Sam, I got you. I'm here. She's gonna want this. Is the bullet still in there? Didn't punch through. We gotta, we gotta get it out, right? There's too much blood. You're gonna have to use this. I'll hold her down. There it is. This is gonna really fucking hurt. <laughs> Hold her down. You two. We got her. Saving her life. Uh, With that? Are you insane? Let me do this. Uh, I've almost got the wound closed. Uh, James, let me.
Is she going to make it? I can't lose her. I can't. My poor Samantha. I don't know. But we did all we could. Tell me. What happened? You appear out of nowhere, with my daughter nearly bleeding to death? That bullet was supposed to hit me. Got Sam instead. Then it should be you lying on this table. Look at me. I don't know who the hell you are, but... Dad! Dad? Where is Greg? I'm so sorry. What? What do you mean? Greg didn't come back with them. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> It's okay, boys. It's okay. I'm here. Colette? Elodie? You girls in here? Elodie. I didn't need anything. Girls? You in here?
ఉద్ధరించేసి You left this all behind. Listen, I need your help. With what? I... I can't help you. We don't... We don't have a lot of time. Have you seen two little girls? My daughters, they lived here with their dad. Oh. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I know them. You do? El... Uh, Elodie and... Uh, Colette? Yes. I haven't seen them, though. Look, we really can't be here, okay? They'll find us! How do you know my girls? Neighbors. Uh, my husband and I babysat a few times. Nice kids. No. <laughs> Who were you talking to? You were talking to yourself. You okay? Just thinking about someone I once knew. It's okay. I do that too. John, he... he went to talk to the kids, make sure they're all right, while I watched over you. Sorry about this. John isn't big on people he doesn't know. Are the kids holding up? I don't know. Can't be good. Their brother's dead, sister's shot. I mean, fuck, right? So, yeah, this is where I apologize for almost shooting you. Emphasis on almost. I was just worried. You almost got us killed. Sam killed. I know that now. That's why I wanted to say sorry. Can't blame me for being cautious. You could be scary as fuck, you know. If it makes you feel any better, I'm not 
a great shot. That patch of dirt, his mom's buried there. A year or so back, she just... She was sick. Not in the head. Something with her heart. She couldn't handle it, I guess. I never understood that. You can't give in. You have to keep going, no matter what. Sam said the same thing to her mom, just a few days before. When she did it, I'd never seen Sam so angry. If it wasn't for Sam... Sam. Hey, don't move, okay? Don't move. Sam, no. Mission, we have to help him. You're too weak. Hold me up. Just stay down, Sam. You're hallucinating, Sam. I... I... Greg isn't here, okay? Sam... I know John can make a strong first impression, but he's what's keeping this entire family from being buried out there. You gotta fight like hell for what you care about, right? Something that makes all this shit worth it. You try to protect everyone, you end up protecting no one. Better than not trying at all. You'd be crazy to stay here, John. This woman normally Enough. will... There's no decision to be made on this. I need a word with you. In private. Do you have children? A son? I do. Two little girls. <sighs> it snowed the day my wife died. Her heart gave out. Sam found her. She... She passed in her sleep. We buried her so the boys wouldn't have to see her like that. The snow... It covered her grave. He erased it. Like she'd never been there at all. I'm really sorry for your loss. Thank you. I've tried to focus on our kids. But the past... It always seems to find you. Ever since Sophia, I've tried to keep our family from harm. But we're falling apart, piece by piece. And now that Sam's hurt, and Greg's... I could really use your help. Your friend Pete told me all about Norma. About what happened. 
If she finds us, we wouldn't stand a chance. But you seem like someone who can hold their own. You've got a good thing going here. Safe house, nice family. It's more rare than you know. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Children shouldn't have to see this. Greg never turned into one of these things, did he? Or those... whatever they are. Yeah. Yeah, he did. My boy. I should have never let him leave. I... I'm sorry. I'm trying to keep it together. But what if you just found out your daughters were dead? And you weren't there. You were miles away, safe and sound. How would you feel? There would be nothing else worth living for. What's left of my family? That's what I'm living for. Peekaboo. Where are you?
You all right? Not dead yet. Uh, uh, you? Must be pretty proud of yourself, huh? Caught yourself a golden goose. You think I'm shitting any eggs? Forget it. I'm asking the questions here. Say now, won't this be fun? That's up to you. Does Norma know we're here? She doesn't even know I'm here. Otherwise, you'd be hearing a neighborly knock on your door right about now. Randall? Randall, are you getting this? You, uh, want to get that for me? We heard gunshots. If you don't check in, I'm sending everyone in that direction. Shit. She sounds pissed. Randall, pick up, goddammit. You gonna answer? Talk to her, Michelle. Don't make the same mistake again. Where the hell are you? You heard her. Randall needs to check in. You know, this feels mighty familiar. Except you're there, and I'm here. So, Miss Sean, what do you want me to say to her? On account of me hoping to avoid more broken fingers, your wish is my command. Call off your sister, or I break every bone in your hand. I'll play nice. Hey, Norma. Randall, are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. But Miss Schoen here is mighty upset. She wants me to call you off. What? Yeah, I know. So you probably shouldn't head for a house southwest of the tower. Hey! I wasn't finished yet. I was doing what you said, Miss Schoen. I have your brother. Michelle. Did you hurt him? If you so much as breathed on my brother, I'll find you and make what happened on the ferry look like a goddamn picnic! Know any good surgeons? I want to look into that. You bitch! This little game you're playing, I don't fucking like it. We'll be there soon. This alone time, you and me together, it's been real nice. But that all ends when my sister gets here. I'm gonna take that wrench, and break your skull. And then Sam's, and then yours. And last but not least, those kitties too. I saw their little heads in the window. Kids, you know, their skulls don't break so much as kind of melt. Guess I hit a button. Michonne. Well, hey now. Don't you two look like your daddy? Back when he still had a face. <laughs> what? Yeah. Got a big hole there now. Sean? Is that true? Please don't. 
tell me he's fucking with us. Randall murdered your dad, Sam. No! Good question asked all night. Michonne's just been fumbling around like a bear cub fucking a football. He keeps opening his mouth. He'll be dead soon. We should do it right fucking now! All she wants is her brother back. That's it. We're out of the equation. You need to kill him, or I will. Sam, wait! No matter what I say, you're just gonna do whatever you want anyway. I know you've already made up your mind. Well, <laughs> I ain't I the bell of the ball. Well, maybe that's you. Because when this dance is over, you're fucked. Kill me, and Norma hunts you down until you're all dead. Fucked! Let me live, and I do even worse. Fucked. But we both know how this is gonna end, Michonne. You like killing. And you'd like killing me, wouldn't you? Just tell old Randall the truth. I got thick skin. You're right about that. Feels good to get that out in the open, don't it? Well, maybe. Maybe you think you can rise above all that. But there ain't no heaven up there, honey. And there ain't no hell down below. There's only this shit every day until you die. Then you know what's the fucking kicker? You get up and keep walking. If you got a point, get to it already. On my way, darling. This is the world your kids are dying in, Michelle. <gasps> or dying in, or are in that fucking purgatory. Shut up. Don't talk about that. Either way. They're suffering. And mommy isn't there. We all have our demons, honey. Guess that means the dance is over. Oh well, Norma will be here soon. Your funeral. I spent a lot of time in low, low places. Where you only have your thoughts for company. And those can be mean, nasty. You want to believe all lives and old deaths have a purpose. Believe me, they don't. It's true. Things always fall apart. But we're the ones who bring them down. 